Hey guys, Shayna Vlogs here. Um, I don't know why I'm calling myself that. I usually just say hey guys. Shardy's like a melody in my Anyways, today, as you hopefully saw yesterday's video, I did a shine bikini haul. But today, I'm going to be doing a shine clothing haul. Now, I've ordered a shirt or two from shine before just for a party I was going to because it was neon themed and I had nothing neon. And actually, it was really nice. That's enough of the rambling. I just really want to get onto the video. I have my bra on speed dial just in case we need it. First thing I picked up was this purple floral shirt. Also, I'll be putting everything in their prices right beside this. This is the shirt on. Now, I do have naturally like more saggy boobs, so I would probably wear a bra with this top. Let me see what it looks like. All right, I definitely feel more like secure with a bra on. It's actually a really cute top. For the price, which I'm pretty sure is really cheap, it's actually really nice. But yeah, I rate this shirt a 9 out of 10. Next shirt I'm picking up is this neon top. I got two neon tops. This is the one I bought a few months ago for a party. Alright, this is the first neon top on. One thing I will say is that this is a little bit droopy, unfortunately, but it is really nice. Mm -hmm. So I rate this shirt a 8 out of 10 because... Next up, I have this top. It is a super thin material and you can see through, but that's why I'm just wearing a white bra, so it's nice. I rate this a an eight out of 10. I did think it would be thicker material. I thought it would like push my boobs up like this, but nah, it's just really thin material. Next thing I'm picking up is this purple lace tank top. Now this top seems like silk and it's kind of damp. Wow, this shirt is a small, it actually, it's very big on me. Not happy about that. But it does have adjustable straps. I don't know what kind of bra you're supposed to wear with this, but you know, it feels very, it's very stretchy. Like a very stretchy cotton. Anyways, I rate this shirt, you know what, I'll give it a 6 out of 10, honestly. It's really loose for a size small. I really thought it was going to be nice and like tighter. And it's really like 6 out of 10. The next shirt I'm picking up is this white ribbed t-shirt. All right, I love it, actually. It's looking very nice on me. Um, It's see-through, pretty see-through, but like, you know, it's kind of like a sketchy website, so not really mad at it. This is the shirt it comes with. Am I dumb? Did I really just say that? <laughs> I rate this shirt an eight out of 10. Um, The sleeves are like a little tight, if that makes any sense. It's just like, like I have to put effort into raising my arm. This next shirt I'm picking up is just a uh, white floral tank top. All right, so this is it. Uh, I think I need to pull it up a little bit. It's kind of see-through like everything else, but it actually is nice and tight fitted on me. I am loving that. It's actually really soft. I like the feeling of this material. I like the shirt 9 out of 10. I mean, I'm not like in love with it, but it is a really nice shirt. So the next thing I'm picking up is this orangey color dragon lettuce trim top. All right, this is the top. I actually really like it. It's not an itchy mesh material, which you usually find in these kind of shirts, but this one's actually really nice. Like it's actually comfortable. I mean, it isn't usually something I'd buy, but it's actually really nice. I rate this shirt a nine out of 10. You know, it's not really my style, but it's, it's really cute. And I do see myself wearing this in the future. This next thing I'm picking up is a black tank top. So this is the tank top. Now I got this top for one reason and one reason only. I don't even know if you can read it. Is it backwards? Anyways, um, I didn't really think of what the writing said, but it says, that's right, I wish you, which I don't know if that's like translated from like Mandarin, sorry, I am really dumb. So translated from Mandarin might mean something else, but I write this shirt. Um, it's kind of loose. Um, I don't really like how it fits. I'll rate it a 7 out of 10. I'm giving most the rates just for what it looks like. The next thing up, I'm actually kind of scared to try on. I ordered this in an extra small because people said it ran a bit big. Alright, so this is the skirt. I am very much not a skirt person, but I'm actually kind of liking this. This is actually, I think, the cheapest skirt they have. I didn't really want to go all out on buying a skirt because I don't even wear them. Because I like to sit crisscross applesauce wherever I go. And it's an issue with the skirt. I think it would look better with a different top, like maybe a plain white top it's not that like tight fitting i thought it was definitely gonna be like tight to the skin but it's like loose i rate this skirt a 8 out of 10 again not in love with it it's nice it's nice next thing up we have this scandalous cherry top this top is to be worn without a bra <laughs> oh my goodness can i tie this closer together okay so i definitely should have ordered this top in a size up but this is it 
I'm just gonna hold it like this for now. Um, if it's hard again, like maybe I could pin it out the bottom here. The bow kind of like hides the fact that there's cleavage, but yeah. I rate this shirt a seven out of 10. Um, this is my fault for not ordering a size up. I didn't realize that it had shown this much cleavage. So I got three. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna put on a different shirt right now just to finish my haul. Next up, I have this cheetah print top. Cheetah print top. It took me a while to tie up the little strings on the, each shoulder because it came really knotted. I had to take a little bit of an intermission there. Um, I feel like you're not supposed to wear this with a bra. I mean, it's cute without a bra, but I feel like I have no support and that my boots can fall out at any moment. But this shirt is very cute. I rate this shirt an 8 out of 10. That's all. Next up, I wanted to show you guys my belt. So this is the first belt I got. I'm, I don't even know what they look like in person yet. So it is very shiny and glittery. You can tell in the light. I think it's probably too big. It will poke holes. Their belts are actually really cheap, so I actually just wanted to try them out. This next one I actually thought was really cool, and it's just this clear belt. I expected it to be like a harder material, but it's like flimsy, but it's cool. I like it. I like it. I like it. The last belt I got was just this snakeskin print because I thought it was really pretty and I want to wear it with like black or white jeans. I thought it'd be cool to look so... Yeah, those are my belts. <laughs> the last thing I got, which I'm most nervous to try on, which is why I left it for last. Maybe I'm too long for this. So actually, it's just my size. Um, It doesn't really look that great on me, but I do really like it. This is the reason I got a belt. More specifically, this belt. Thought these would look nice together. Put a little belt in the middle. It's twerkable, which is very effective. I've just got a huge mess to clean up now. Anyways, guys, thank you for watching today's video. Uh, it was a little bit of a adventure. Oh, what do I rate this? I didn't even rate it. I'll give it um, an 8 out of 10. It's nice, it's nice. Okay, anyway, thank you for watching. Like and subscribe, and I'll see you in my next vlog. Bye!